Hello there beautiful Minecraft addicts uh, I wanted to make a short tutorial for you There are um, quite a few tutorials on the, on YouTube about uh, this But I, I felt like uh, doing a video And uh, I felt like explaining in more detail uh, uh, this, this situation So uh, you know the situation You want to have two doors instead of one And you want to open them both Okay, so because I don't know one door is just too boring, you know, just to go through one door, open it, close it. You can do this, of course, and it closes behind you, and this again, but it, it, it's kind of boring. So, I want two doors, okay? So but wait, what happens? Why can't I? What? This one opens, but this one doesn't. This one closes when I step on it. The problem is that uh, the door with the hinges on the right, or one of the doors, because <laughs> uh, if you look at it this way, this has the hinges on the right, so one of the doors um, receive, doesn't receive the same signal uh, to open as the other door okay it receives it has to receive an inverted signal so this pressure plate here should uh, send a reverted signal now i wanted to see if we, uh, it's because of the placement but you can see um, wherever i place them they're the same okay so let's try and build on that being explained Okay, if we place them here, okay, they do like this, and uh, I can't really invert the signal because it's transmitted directly from this block to this block. Okay, so how do I do it? I need to put it one uh, one block further. If I put it here, the same problem. Okay. So, okay, one block further, that means for this part over here and for this part, because I already put it here, means you have to put it that on that side. So, I usually like to put it uh, when I, uh, I, this part on the interior, okay, and uh, from the outside maybe a button or just open one of the doors because I don't want creepers to be able to open my doors uh, just by stepping on the plates, okay? So, this is the the pressure plate placement. Okay, so now what do we do? Uh, well, first of all, in order to uh, transmit the signal from a pressure plate to a door you need to put under the pressure plate redstone okay let me just for the purpose of demonstrating okay watch that red that rest on there and you see it's power now okay the same signal from uh, both uh, plates okay so how do I get the signal to the st uh, to the stairs. Now, of course, I've watched uh, several um, other tutorials on how to do this. I've been doing this for a while now, actually, and I was just interesting. Okay, how other people do it? Um, my preferred uh, model is with two restones like that. Okay, there are mothers that uh, use redstones in this. Um, I don't know if you can see. Let me just in this pattern, but that just uh, means you have to put. Those are basically inverters, so you have to put another inverter. There's a, a, a quite a, some hassle, so uh, let's work with this one for now okay 
so in order to get my signal from these two redstone to those torches I have to make something like this okay let me just put one here you see it's connected there is also connected but uh, when I press the plate it doesn't do anything so what's happening what's the matter why doesn't do anything the thing is redstone doesn't uh, work that way don't ask me why you have to put a bigger loop around it okay done it let's try it now so that uh, op door should open and voila now it works okay so let's do the same thing on this side a bigger loop okay and see if that happens let me put the other pressure plate over here also and there you go or let me just leave for a second so you can see better just a moment guys okay but now there's a problem of still one is open one is closed so that's that one is good because it's uh, closed and now when I press it's open but that one doesn't so that means I have to invert the signal that needs to be closed and that needs to stay the way the way it is how do I invert the signal now to invert the signal you use a basic inverter which is something like uh, something like this let's make one uh, okay actually here you see it inverts the signal let's show that so that's off that's on and now that's on that's off basic inverter okay so how do you use that here you usually would put something like this okay let's see if that works and voila like magic I uh, usually like to let's see if another another way works and again I don't know it's I, I feel it's more compact that way but uh, that's just my uh, <laughs> my way, way of thinking about it so that being said these two we don't need them there let's cover this up so we need to the pressure plates over these two redstone wires okay let's put the pressure plates just not to forget them and yay the thing is you go out of your house and uh, the uh, doors stay open enough just for you to allow you to go through them which is kinda nice well that's about it I am planning to do a tutorial to open this with a button but uh, that's a little bit more complicated and I, I just need a little bit of practice before I show you how that works it's uh, it's basically the button connects to the that um, rest on there or you put some other um, the same exactly the same uh, layout on the other side for the button to work yeah um, hope you enjoyed and I hope I was clear enough you understood me uh, please rate it and subscribe 
and don't forget to be awesome guys. Ciao!